Hello everybody, I'm here, Clayton Prispan, I'm back, and uh, first of all, I would like to apologize for all this lack of communication. I know I haven't been uploading a lot of videos recently. Um, what happened, because I'm a final, uh, a third year student here in Ireland, so it's my last year in IT, so obviously there are loads of assignments and uh, our main project to be done so um and as you guys can see everything's changed here uh, where i live in uh my partner painting the the apartment so uh now we have a different a different um scenario and anyways it's more interesting because now i'm standing i think i feel more free to to speak anyway so um that's the the one thing okay the second thing i i Try, still trying to create new content, so that's why it's very important. So you give me your your opinion, you give it a thumbs up and post here in the comments. Uh, I'm gonna post the the other videos I recorded in English. Uh, I have some videos in Portuguese as well because my audience, you know, it's mixed. I'm not sure if I if I'm gonna if I will create a separated channel only in Portuguese and let this one only in English, for videos only in English, so I'm not sure what I'm going to do. So uh, you guys tell me, but um, at least, I mean, if you if you see a video in Portuguese or if you're not understanding the title, the video title, you can be sure in the description I post things in English, I post the, ins the instructions, so you can find my, my videos in English, so you wouldn't be lost at all, all right? I try to cope with both audiences, Okay, so um, that's it. So that's my the the second uh, thing I would like to say. And uh, but uh, today's video, uh, I'd like to talk. Uh, I didn't prepare anything. I didn't prepare any script because I don't have time. You know, I've, I have a very short time to to the thing, so I I, I couldn't prepare anything. You know, uh, but uh, the one thing that have have been called my attention recently. I mean, a lot of things regarding. Uh, regarding Bolsonaro, the Brazilian president, that you guys might have known because I mean he's he's becoming a very sad and 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 disgraceful personality, a disgraceful politician because that's what he is. He's a homophobic, he's misogynist, he's racist, okay, and uh, he he's he's that kind of a pseudo conservative person that believes in the strength of of, of weapons to know against violence uh, he has a very old-fashioned and stereotype uh, perspective uh, about LGBT people and about women and he thinks in Brazil for example that it's a very unequal country whoever person who had already traveled to Brazil noticed Brazil, it's a country of contrasts, all right? And if you go to favelas, if you go to, to poor areas in Brazil, you're going to see a lot of mixed and black people there. So, and this comes, it, it's a very long story. I can record another video explaining this, but basically these, these issues are still, you know, the results of the slavery. The opportunities for those people are not the same for people who are, I would say, you know, more uh, economically privileged, you know. So, uh, and but for him, no, you know, they, they for, for Bolsonaro, he thinks, he believes, you know, in a thing in a, in meritocracy, you know. I don't know if it is an, a, a word in English as well. Anyway, so he believes in merito merito meritocracy, you know, and he thinks people can, you know, dispute uh, equally. You know, so people from, from from poor areas and people from you know who are economically well, um, who are economically better, you know, than those people, they can dispute in uh, equally. You know, so they can, for example, apply for colleges in Brazil and for universities. They can have the same resources of st studies. You know, they can study uh, in the same way. So you know, people in favela. You know, they have to deal with the, with violence. They have to deal with drug dealing. You know, so it's not equal. So they can't even step out of their home to go to college to to study. 
So it's not equal. So this concept of meritocracy doesn't apply in those cases. So, but uh, Bolsonaro believes in this. Do not believe? No. If you, if people from poor, poor areas, if they study hard, they can get the same opportunities. Yeah, they can. They they can learn if they want to. Do not. But it's not the same because they have to work, also to work. And people who 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 comes from from wealthy families or do not middle classes families do not. They don't have. Some of them don't even have to work, especially if you're studying uh, medicine. Uh, medicine. Yeah, if you're about to become a doctor, don't know, uh, anyways, a general practitioner or some specialist, don't know, in health, inside the health system, um, because it's a full-time, don't know, study, Monday, Friday, sometimes even in, even weekends, so um, they can't, they can't work. So people who come from, from wealthy families, don't know, or well-loaded families, they have the opportunity to study without working because their families can can support them. But it doesn't happen with poor people because working is not an option. They have to work and that's it to pay the bills and to make ends meet. So that's it, you know. So he has this kind of a old fashioned and very wrong perspective about things. He doesn't know Brazil. He, he's a Brazilian, he doesn't know. He doesn't know the real Brazil because he, I, I don't believe he have ever step into uh, a favela or really talk to people you know on on the you know the lower situation the, the most you know the degrading situation he never he never been there to see the reality or he knows the reality because information is everywhere and he decided not to pay attention to that and created this whole upside our world inside his mind. The last thing is the uh, this segregation he's you know, putting in people's mind regarding the the left and the right. I think in most of countries, you know, uh, I think you guys don't believe, don't make like, you know, you have to you have to eliminate the right or you have to eliminate the left, you know, and people in the middle, they are the worst, you know, I don't think, I don't believe you guys think like this, at least People here in Ireland, they don't think like this, you know, even though Ireland, I mean, as long as I could read, you know, Ireland is considered kind of a center leftist, you know, but uh, anyways, uh, but uh, I've never heard, you know, people, you know, um, saying that the right is wrong or trying to eliminate the left, but in Brazil, Bolsonaro, you know, he, he feels he's the, the captain of this war, you know, against the left. He wants to eliminate the left because he believes Brazil is under a communist threat, all right? And one of the things that makes this very clear how, how hard they, they are trying to, to apply all these bad things to the leftists is the fact that he believes Nazis, Nazism is, is, a, is a left, was a left movement, you know? And it's ridiculous. Because everybody knows Nazism, you know, the Nazists, they were extreme, they were far right. And the history says this, you know, the Germans say this nowadays, you know, historians, you know, the Holocaust Museum says this. And uh, so he wants to, to reinvent everything. So anyway, so he's a, he's a mess. He's, his mind is totally out of this world. That's why I have no reasons to support him. I, I've been knowing him for at least almost for, for 10 years already, you know, so uh, because, of, because of his declaration in some, some TV shows, you know, in the past. So it's not something new. Uh, so I have my reasons to not support him. And uh, again, I enjoy the opportunity I have to speak in English because I can tell the world how, how disgraceful this guy is, okay? So that's it for today, guys. Uh, if you like this video, don't forget, okay, to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. It's very important, okay, guys, to make this message being passed forward. Stay tuned for, for more nice things here in the channel, right, guys? So see you in the next video. Take good care. Take it easy. Bye-bye.